Today, I will be explaining introduction of organizational behavior. Short form is OB. So, let's see first of all the outlines of the session. First, we will discuss about the definition of organizational behavior. Next, need of OB. Next, we will see importance of OB. And at last, we will see OB, that means organizational behavior with chart. Let's say first of all the questions that to be asked in the examination. Why one should study organizational behavior? Discuss in context of need and importance of studying organizational behavior. The weightage can be 7 marks. So let's see one by one about these two questions. First, definition of organizational behavior. Organizational behavior is defined as the systematic study and application of knowledge about how individuals and groups act within the organizations where they work. So basically there are three different parts. First one, the OB is actually the systematic study and application of knowledge. Second part, about how individuals and groups act within the organization and at last where they work. So it is really very easy to remember the definition of OB by considering these three parts. Next, OB can be defined as the understanding, prediction and management of human behavior affect the performance of the organization that is given by Luthans. So, it is also a very simple definition. Once again, see carefully. OB can be defined as the understanding, prediction and management of the human behavior. And that will be directly affect the performance of the organizations. One more definition of OB. OB is the study of human behavior in organizational setting of the interface between human behavior and the organization and of the organization itself that is by K. Aswathappa. One more definition. Organizational behavior is the study and application of knowledge about how people act within organizations that is given by Davis and Newstrom. So I think this is a very simple definition. In the examination, you should write this definition. So, once again, see carefully. Organizational behavior is the study and application of knowledge. It is like this. Study and application of knowledge about how people act within organizations. Next, need of organizational behavior. So, why it is required to study organizational behavior? Let's see. The study of organizational behavior means OB is very interesting and challenging too. It is related to individuals and group of people working together in teams. So basically organizational behavior is related to the individuals as well as group of people working together. The study of organizational behavior relates to the expected behavior of an individual in the organization. So it is very important. The study of OB relates to the expected behavior of an individual in the organization. So with the help of this OB, you can expect a certain behavior of the individual in the organization. Next, no two individuals are likely to behave in the same manner in a particular work situation. So that is a common thing. So it is desirable for a manager to predict the expected behavior of an individual. But there are no absolutes in human behavior. So actually it is desirable for a manager of any one company to predict the expected behavior of their employees as an individual. But unfortunately, there are no absolutes in the human behavior. But at least you can predict 
a certain behavior with maximum probabilities. In fact, human factor is the main contributor to the productivity and hence the study of human behavior is very important. Next, the human behavior as an individual or in a group is a crucial element for the organizational success. Out of seven resources, means man, machine, materials, money, methods, markets and minutes or you can say time. Out of these seven M, last six that means machine, materials, money, method, markets and minutes which are non-human, you know very well, but are deployed by human resources. While human resource that means man is employed by organization. So from that you can understand why it is so much important to study the behavior of the person in the organization. In short you can say the importance of the organization behavior is like this to understand the reason why people behave in certain way. Next to understand why one team is more effective than the other. Next, to understand why one individual is competent than the others. So it is very simple comparison of the employees in the group. Next, to understand process through which utilization of resources is possible. Next, to understand basis of motivation and what a manager should do to motivate the employees. So once again it is also a very important point for the success of organization to understand basis of motivation for the employees and what a manager should do to motivate the employees. Next to understand various ways for developing interpersonal relations in an organization. So now you can say the summary of the importance of organizational behavior first. It helps to build a better relationship in an organization by achieving social, corporate and people's objectives. Next, it builds goodwill of the organization. So obviously it is required for any one company. It converts people into valuable resources through various practices. It helps in better coordination within the organization. It helps to achieve objectives at a fast pace. It facilitates motivation. It improves relations in an organization. It helps to optimize utilization of resources. It results in higher level of efficiency. It helps to evaluate performance of people by different methods and techniques. Already we have discussed in the previous slides the importance of the organizational behavior. But this is actually the summary of the importance of organizational behavior. And that you can write in the examination also. At last, this is the chart or you can see the figure that represents the importance of the organizational behavior research. So here you can see there are actually three parts. First one, understanding organizational events with the help of the organizational behavior research. Next, influence on organizational events. So by predicting the organizational behavior, you can understand influence on organizational events and at last prediction of organizational events. So organizational behavior research indicates these three important points. If you have any question then write in the comment box. Thanks my dear friends for watching this video. Press the like button to appreciate it.